Shoemaker Levy 9 was um, interesting because named after Gene Shoemaker, we witnessed in the second week of July in 1994, 21 pieces of the original nucleus plunge into the Jovian atmosphere with pretty impressive results. And after that, I think there was a more of an interest in looking at evidence of multiple impact events. And these are called catena, which are these like apparently where you have a, like this, this would have been an object that broke up, had not had time to disperse along its orbital path. And so when it struck the surface of this is, I believe this one's on the moon, it was like almost like a rapid machine gun fire. And I think Robert Shock would say that this was probably a plasma discharge. I'm more inclined to believe that it was a multiple impact event. We know that impacts occur. We know that there's all kinds of debris out there in space. So I'm of the mind that yes, we should absolutely consider the sun as a, as a major factor. And there is evidence, like he showed yesterday, there's evidence that the sun, I think, does go through hyperactive phases. But at the same time, I don't dismiss the impact phenomena, in my mind, is still the dominant effect.